As a trim carpenter, one of the most important and versatile tools that I own are my routers. As you can see, I have a pretty decent collection of them, but they all serve a different purpose. When I'm out on the job, my trimmers are usually my go-to. Their compact size, balance, and the ease of operation with one hand make them the ideal choice for the on-site carpenter. That's why when the folks at Fine Home Building asked me if I was interested in trying out this new battery-operated Makita, I jumped at the chance. I actually tried it out the other day, I guess you could call it a preliminary test, and I found out I was able to get 38 8-foot pine boards using a quarter-inch cove at full depth. Now, I wasn't making pretty cuts, I was trying to kill it, and that's the same thing I'm going to do today. Because to me, that's real-world information. A finished carpenter on site is going to be using 8 and 16 foot material, right? So again, these aren't going to be pretty cuts. I'm not trying to make furniture. I'm trying to kill this router. Stay tuned. That's it. Bam. I think my hand wore out before the router did. Look at that pile of sawdust too. All right, so what do we got? Two, three, four, five, six, seven on all four sides. That's 28, 29, 30, 30 and a half. That is not too bad with that cove and bead set. Uh, it, I mean, it handled the same way from start to finish. It had the same amount of power. Uh, I'm really pleased with this router. Uh, I definitely would uh, recommend it. So that's all.